Good morning. Yo. It is just before nine in the AM, and we're heading out on a club ride with a good old Darby Mercury, aka it's the return of Nigel, or as other people call him Nige. Not seen him in absolutely ages, so I'm sure he'd be absolutely delighted to be back on the camera. Uh, we're just doing about forty-seven miles, Maloney's. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe a bit extra because we've got to get there and back. Just a club ride. Um, cafe involved. Yes, to the please. One I've not been to before, so I'm ready for that. And yesterday I had my bike fit, so it's the first time riding my bike in the new position. I haven't got the new saddle yet, it's on order, but I'm just excited to you know, feel more comfort, so let's see how that goes. So we're just one Maloney in. This bike, honestly, I cannot believe I used to ride the way I did. My shoulders are relaxed, my bum feels comfy, it's absolutely great, but absolute mistake we've made is we've just realised that um, yesterday when we got my bike back out of the car after the bike fit, we didn't tighten the wheel on properly, so I've just ridden for a mile with the wheel not even in, which is very dangerous. Well, it's, no, it's very loose. I mean, that's not even on. It's not even in, is it? not even screwed at all. Oh my goodness. Gravity was keeping that way. Always check your bike before you leave. I'm very silly. Well, for once, we're the first here today and Carl's whipping out his flask already. While we wait for the other lot, might as well have a hot cup of char. Is it char letter? Char. Not char. What's char? Just, I don't know. I've just heard it on film before. Reunited like and it here. feels so good. Because <laughs> they do all the better. Oh, I've missed this so much. Yeah, but, uh, look what he's got on his bike. This is Christmas, isn't it? So we've got to have Christmas lights. Where's your Christmas lights? I know, I should miss No, actually, I did go to a club ride. Some poor soul. Today. I did see it, I did see it, and I'm just watching you not dressed as a sugar plum fairy today. I know. I will do. Maybe next week. I'm so glad I got this bike because I keep feeling like, oh, I f like, you know when you have that feeling where you should have a rucksack on but you've not, like you've forgotten something? And then I'm like, oh no, it's just because my shoulders are relaxed. It feels so like nice, it's weird. Well, Slight just... issue, <laughs> um, the right. brake's falling off. Go back there, see if it's <laughs> oh, that's a bit Oh about... my goodness. Only this, only this pad. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing, I've got a spare one on the back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what happens if you don't have one on? Will it just not stop? It won't stop. Uh, uh, yeah, that's generally the idea. <laughs> so we're now outside Harper's because Gordon put his back <coughs> brake pad onto his front brake, so he's got no back brake, so he's gone to get some brake pads. Luckily, there was a Harper's right near us, so it's all right. Yeah. Basically, seen another tour of Derby. Choose to go with them. That's why the old lot. I think the bloke says I find him such a faff because he can never. He says he can never get them out to replace them. I was like, mm. <laughs> just break and they drop out on your bike. No roads in sight so far. Absolutely great. And even though it's December, it's quite warm. It's about six degrees, so no ice around today. Blended. Ooh, ooh, some bumpies for riding along the canal. It's beautiful. There's no swans around though. Where are all the swannies gone? Maybe it's too cold for them to hibernate in. Oh, blow my neck. It's nice to just get outside. I've been on the turbo all week, so it's been horrible weather. Ooh. Yeah, so, so far, no rain. Oh yeah. Gotta celebrate the little things in life, like no rain on a day. Well, I found the swans. I don't know if you can see them, but they're in the blooming field because it's flooded. So they've migrated from the canal to the fields. Well, my neck. We've just stopped because, as usual, Kyle needs a wee. Well, my neck, look, I won't video it today. Don't worry, we didn't want to see that. <laughs> Kyle's got bird poo I'm on his jacket. Oh, lovely. Hold me back. Okay, good luck. Why haven't you told you about? I'm going to roll in the grass. What do you mean? How are you going to get it off? Oh. oh, my. Have you ever had a bike fit, Joe? Uh, yes. Yeah, I had I've, one yesterday. Have you? Where First you time do? ever, a UK bike fit. Oh, okay. Yeah, nice. How, so, how, what was the difference like between what, what so you So my had? cleats were in the wrong place, yeah. completely. Yeah. <laughs> Handlebars were too high and too upright. Right, yeah. Um, Your saddle? My saddle's wrong. Ah, okay. Even new saddle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the, because of the way the mood had been, like, the pressure was all on the front of the Yeah, side. so the pressure was all on the front of my bottom, basically, instead of the back. Right. So, so that's, gonna make that's why I got, yeah, because basically on PBP, I got saddle sort in the wrong area. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. When did you, how long have you been cycling for? You had one. I've probably been racing about a year. Yeah. And then I then had a bike fit because I was racing track. So I was just, oh. Oh, I just wanted to make sure I was, I was optimal. Yeah. Was and it worth it? Yeah, you? it was worth it because yeah. my stem was too long. So I oh. pulled that stem back and it just pulled, pulled my weight back on my saddle. Oh. It got me a bit more. That's what I did on mine, I think. Mm. Carl's not had one yet, have you? But you're going to in the new year. Yeah. Yeah. Have you ever had a VO2 max test? No, I have We're doing that in January. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice. <laughs> Bit scared about it. Yeah. yeah. Where are you doing that? UK bike fit oh, again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Now I'll probably just be depressed if I did one. <laughs> and the rain has come. At least I've got my Gore-Tex on, but 
can't say it's very enjoyable in this weather, but five Malone's from the cafe, so that'll warm my cod loins up. Ugh. Yippee! Woohoo! About getting blown, blown down here, blow me neck. Ugh, it's horrible. I'm huddled in a bus shelter. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, we've lost a few of the group. No. I think they might have stopped. So I don't know where they are. That's not why we're huddled in a bus shelter. Oh, why are we huddled? <laughs> we just like that sort of thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's what we'll we just... do for a hobby. Yeah. <laughs> Is the cafe we'll soon? Yes, we'll probably no. Just oh. It's just around the corner. We'd just rather stand okay. here in the rain. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Here he comes. About 20 miles, isn't it? You're all right, Nigel. Mark's got a puncture. Oh, oh blooming oh, 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 never puncture. Normally, it's always a puncture. We've got, got gravel tyres on as well. Tubulous gravel tyres. Wrong. Oh. <laughs> I just free wheeled down that hill and I felt like I was being pelted in the face with ice. I feel like an ice cube on a bike. Nigel's the colour of an ice cube. <laughs> But well, as Nigel said, it could be worse. You could be out bivvying somewhere, which I suppose. Uh, what would you want? Yeah, why would you want to go abroad this time of year when you can just ride in the UK and you get weather like this? I mean, come on, it's lovely. It's an advertisement for UK riding this. It's just come into a place called Whitwick. I don't know about Whitwick, more like wet wet. I'm at the end of my blooming wick. Ugh, it's rank. Oh, we are in a nice little tea room. It's lovely. Oh, Kyle, pigs and blackens. Roast turkey. Oh, roast turkey scuffed stuff in the cup. Ooh. <laughs> Go on, Nigel, you can get this. Get caffeine. Nigel's getting annoyed at me. It's falling a cue, everyone else is in the rain. Why are you doing this all up? Fantastic. There wasn't enough room for us to all sit together, so me and Kyle have been um, put to the corner, and Nigel and everybody's over there, <laughs> waving to Nigel from my seat. Because we're cold, we've put our little gloves by the fire. <laughs> So they're warming up, hopefully, because we're absolutely sodden. Hot chucky. They didn't do chai latte, but you don't expect it in a nice little old place like this, so I'm happy with this. I don't know what Nigel's having over there, but he's over there. Is it strong? God help them on the way back. Oh, blooming heck. How's cod loins are whipping well fast on the way back now? No, I've been having electrolytes. Oh, he's adding sugar in as well? I've been having electrolytes, so... Oh, blooming heck. This was just said in the morning, so we're going to mix that up. Tastes sweet like nectar. Blooming heck, look what he's got. What is that? Like a... A gravy. I thought it was meant to be gravy sauce. It's like mayo. Anyway, you'll eat it. It'll do you. And I've got a lovely jacket potato. It's going to go straight down my gullet. Get it down me. What? What's me? Oh, thanks. Fuck you later. Well, that's you. That's you, Kyle. Yeah. Hey, honey, honey, and a hat cha cha. If you watch Lauren and Hardy, it's off that. <laughs> Oh, so my gloves are bad, yeah, but they're still, need, they're still absolutely soaked. These are fine. They're lobsters. Oh, they are, aren't they? Yeah. Lobsters. I've looked at lobsters buying some because you've got rain They've got spare gloves with them. That's what we need to do. What ones them. are they? Just any My old. hands are frozen. These are Aldi. Oh. Aldi. What, what are they? Need. Aldi. They look really good, they Silk do. I need some of them. Oh, silk, is it? Is it you kept telling what you silked? No, I didn't know what it you was. You did? <laughs> I said to Carl, I used to get some gloves with silk in. He was like, Amy, it's not silk, it's silk. I was like, what's silk? Pig silk. So we yeah. can now confirm it is silk lined gloves. Kyle's making fun of me saying it yeah. should be silk. <laughs> Kyle, what is silk? <laughs> silk doesn't even <laughs> exist, does it? Silk does. Silk is finer than sand. It's like a very fine mud. Right, so you're not going to line like your gloves with that then? <laughs> not unless you fall. Because Kyle was laughing at me like, oh, why would you want silk? But it is good in the wind, I think. Oh my goodness, listen to the sound. I must say, Chaz, I do really love the colour of your bike. Thank you. It's really nice, and the matching bag as well. The trouble with it's bringing great. spare gloves, Amy, is I'm having to put my wet ones in my pocket. Oh yeah. Well, I'd rather have Got wet gloves in my back no. pocket than on my fingers, so. <laughs> We're on the road again. It's not raining, and uh, I'm feeling good. I think when it's raining and horrible on a ride, you can have a little moan about it. You know, everyone wants to moan now and again, but then you just have to think, no amount of moaning is going to change the weather. So you might as well just embrace it and blooming sing in the rain, I say. Me and Kyle are loving it. I mean, it is a bit chilly today, but it's great just to be out. I mean, look at us all. Crew on the road. It's just so nice just to be able to come out and be with other people. And that's what I love about riding. It's just the social side of it as well. So lovely. Oh. Although it wasn't, it, you know, blooming it. It wasn't lovely in the rain on the way here, but you just have to think well I can moan about it and be sad about it and and hate the ride or I can change my attitude and just think well I'm lucky to be able to ride and be outside and enjoy my life so just got to think of it that way I think and just be grateful for what you've got so yeah there's people in really bad situations and yeah so to be able to ride in the rain 
is a blessing really, isn't it? Let's put it into perspective. Kyle, can you stop riding no handed because you're going to give me an heart attack? Oh, hello doggies! I hate when Kyle rides no handed because I just think I can just vision him falling off. Kyle's got a puncture, but he's back there sorting it with some of the other guys. Because we all just carried on and lost him. <laughs> Well, it's all right to stop. It was out on the main road, so it's really hard to stop. So they've pulled it on the grass, and we found a little delay bar. It's got to be safe. But I'm just realised that the pump is in my back pocket. But I think one of the other fellas will have a pump, so it's all right. We'll find out in a minute. Well, I'm not very really a fan of the inner tube brand, your car. I think that's a bit of a health and safety risk. It's blingy, isn't it? No, I don't like it. Yeah. Luckily, well, back in the day. Luckily, someone else had a pump, so we're all right. Yeah. Absolutely sodden. This is what we call real rain. Ugh. But you know, you just got to be grateful for being out. So that's why I keep telling myself. Thank you. Hello, ponies. <laughs> oh, they were cute. It's blooming tipping it down. I won't need a blooming shower tonight. I've already had my shower. At least my bike's clean. Clean as my bike's been for a while. Oh, is everyone okay back there? Yeah. Enjoying the free shower? Lovely. It's great, isn't it? What a day to be out on your bike. Oh. Hello sheepy! Oh the sun's come out now, I've loving it, I've had rains, wind and all sorts, but we're ending the ride on sun. And it is beautiful. It all turned out well in the end. Home before sunset, so Carl, you need your back light on. And that's our ride, ding the dang the dudley Ran upstairs and had a quick shower because we're going to be late, we're going to mum and dad's for a curry. Kyle's in the shower, the dog's jumping up at me because he's excited and he's coming, yes you're coming for the curry too. You're coming too. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Gonna be late, so I better go. TT to the FN. Ta-ta for now. Goodbye.